Okay, welcome to the blogs um, by me, Josh. Um, if you're viewing this, you're most probably on um, joshuaangel.co.uk. So feel free to have a look around the the other pages. Today, I just thought I'd pop by and, and have a little chat with you about um, funny frat cakes, which are quite um, quite local to me, and um, obviously I um, want to use them more and more in in food. You know. We need to look at local produce and, and how we can champion it. So really, pony frat cakes for me um, are probably the most important and, and local, locally produced um, product available. So you know, I say this about you know so much, but pony frat cakes really sort of excite me. Um, the round, you know, licorice sweets. Um, and, and they have the imprint of the Pontefract Castle on them, which again gives it its, you know, its brand, its origin. Uh, they've, they've been popular for hundreds of years uh, in this area and and in others. But, but what makes them so, you know, special is that little round black disc just says Pontefract. You know, I can remember. Uh, several years ago, going into um, the town centre of Pontefract um, to the Licorice Festival, and and what really sort of drew my attention was the the auction for the Licorice Bush. You know that that must say something about this area, and, and it's proud to have the Licorice, and it, you know that that said something in the sense that we need to use that, and and I feel that I can use that in food. Which is great. Um, you know, it, it really does mean that much. And once upon a time, Pontefract cakes were only made in Pontefract. And sadly, you know, that's not the case. Um, they are still manufactured in the town, but they are manufactured in others. And it, it was really interesting to see um, uh, one of the local chefs from Ferry Bridge, which is really close to Pontefract. Um, Creating a dish with licorice, um, actually using Pontefract cakes in a dish at the Yorkshire Showground, Tim Bolton. He used a, a Pontefract cake sauce with one of his dishes, which was fantastic. Um, and, you know, I think that putting that on a menu just says, you know, thank you to the people of Pontefract. I think, you know, it's, it's really, it really is quite, quite good. So hopefully yeah, I'm going to uh, go away now and try and develop a couple of recipes and uh, I'll get them uploaded onto the website next week and um, if you've got any comments to leave about it then and please do and um, that's all I can say but um, bye for now.